Alrighty, well, hello, hello. I have already played Distraint 1, and it ended rather horribly. So now it's time to go back into the world of Distraint with Distraint 2. For those of you who have not seen the first play, you're probably going to get some spoilers in this one. So, if you haven't seen it, probably best for you to go see the first one. But, I'm going to continue. So, spoiler warnings. So, in the last game, we came to the conclusion that he couldn't live with the guilt that he had dealt with, and ultimately he had committed suicide. I'm not sure where this game picks up, so I'm not sure if it's picking up with the same character or what, but I guess we'll find out, won't we? So let's go ahead and get started. I haven't even played it, so yes. I love how it always asks me that. Ooh, nice little recap. My name is Price. To gain the partnership with the company, I had to evict people from their homes. Such was the nature of my work. But it soon became clear that the job wasn't right for me. See, there was this sweet elderly widow called Mrs. Goodwin, and I took over her home. Something snapped in me. She never blamed me for anything. Yet I could never forgive myself, especially after she passed away. In the end, I lost the will to live. I put a shotgun barrel in my mouth and decided to end it once and for all. Prologue. Reason. Oh, it is with the same guy! Oh, it is! Alright, so I... Okay. Press A. What is this? Where am I? I... Hello! I see that. <laughs> I shouldn't exist. I shouldn't be anymore. Hey, can anyone hear me? I don't understand. Press oh, press B to run. Oh, I can run in this one. Oh, what's this? Yeah, it's an old man. Okay. Okay, I don't think I need to go that way. Look we'll at him ruined. <laughs> Who are you? What's this? Okay. Excuse me. Where am I and who are you? I am Reason. Unfortunately, I don't know how else to better explain what I am. But I'll be your guide. If you only let me. My guide. Please, listen to what I must tell you. I don't understand. I am part of you. Is that supposed to be like him as an old guy? Oh, I bet he's, like, stuck in limbo and he's having to, like, face different parts of himself. I bet it's something like that. So this is, like, his reason. His name is Reason, so it's his reasoning. We are connected. Reason. 
Yes, I understand how confusing all this must sound. What is this place? There is no easy answer for that question. I can't explain it. I don't get it. I was ready to pull the trigger. Yes, there's no easy way to explain this. But you ended up in this place for a reason. I just wanted to get away. I couldn't live with myself anymore. Why is this happening to me? Yes. See, there are many things you've yet to experience. You need to learn how to forgive yourself. Yep, he's stuck in limbo. I know it. I'm not sure I can. It will be difficult, given your current state. But you can put your faith in me. See, you must find yourself again. You must find hope. This is the only way for you to heal. Everything just feels so overwhelming. Please, find hope, and everything will change. I... I suppose I can try. That's all I can ask of you. We will meet again soon. Whoa. What? Run through the craziness! Nothing happens. Oh, I'm back at like the apartments. Excuse me? Anyone home? I take that as a no. Hello? Could you please open the door? Hey! What the heck? Oh. What the hell? Oh, this guy- Oh, they got money for eyeballs. What do I do? Do I run away? Run away! Oh, I can't run any- Oh. That was me some years ago. Oh, they're not there no more. Alright, that was a little creepy. Yeah, let's open the crazy portal to nothingness. Why not? Seems okay. Eh. Wasn't there a doorway just here a second ago? Yes. Can I go this way? This is the... Okay, so let's start glitching if I can't go some way. Why am I here? Am I dead? Or am I alive? Okay, so those are my save points. Okay. I'm gonna go save first before I do anything else. I saved the game. Whatever that means. Um, let's try this one first. Oh, no can do. The door is locked. Of course it's locked. There's a fire going. Alright, that's blackness. I don't want to go in any rooms just yet. Run! Ooh. I've always enjoyed being around fire. That sounds weird. Huh, what's that? There's something in the fireplace that doesn't belong. Maybe I could poke it with something. Okay. Oh! Wait a minute. Okay. Huh, oh, there's something behind the couch. I wonder if I can move the couch. Huh? What on earth is that thing? I need to take a closer look. Oh, it's missing something! I think there's pe- Yes, yeah, and I already figured that there was a piece missing. Hello, 
Samer. Welcome in. This is called Distraint 2. Oh, wait, no, I need to be in here. Wait a minute. Why do I need to be able to hide? I don't like the fact that I can hide. Old, it's an old and dirty washing machine. It's missing a washer dial. Hey, Kevin, how you doing? Oh, that's one rusty shower. Pipe might come off pretty easy. I got, and I just slid it in my pocket like Mary Poppins. Okay, can't go that way. I, I, I what? What? Wait, what did I click? I don't like the fact that I can hide. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I'm trying to figure this out. Okay, so fireplace. Oh, I can use the pipe to get the... Okay, hang on. It said to... There we go. Aha, just slide the pipe out of my pocket. There we go. And then I gotta... Okay, there we go. Pick up. The heck is this? Looks like a washer dial. Oh! Your dial, huh? Oh, what was that? Did something just move in the shadows? Oh, yes, yeah, something did just move in the shadows. Well, I found out why I gotta hide. Okay, um, no. This. Wonder if it fits here. It does. Press and hold to turn the washer dial. What? Oh, it's like a combination. Oh, what? Yeah, this is actually just straight too. Oh, yeah, that's right, duh. Okay, so... Oh, I did it! There you go. I'll just wait for it to finish. Oh, I don't like that. The hell was that sound? I better hide quickly. Hide! Hide! Oh, it locked me in, so I couldn't even run. What is that thing? Oh, I can't see. Oh, I hope that wasn't too loud on you guys. It got, like, really loud. Is it safe to come out now? What the hell was that thing? What's the meaning of all this? Alright, let's see. An ice cube. Feels way too familiar. Yeah, I know what to do with this ice cube. Must be something inside it. I can leave now. Right away before he comes back. I don't like that sound. I'm sure it'll thaw in a moment. Well, you just throw an ice cut cube in a fire, so of course it will. There was something inside the ice cube. It looked like it was a key. A 
key, but where does it fit? Oh, the locked door. There was a locked door. This door. There we go. There, I unlocked the door. That's darkness. Oh man. Where am I even going? I don't know, dude. I'm just. Oh, that's darkness too. Yep, that's darkness too. What am I doing in here? Oh gosh! Bless it! Holy crap! I'm gonna turn this down just a tick. Holy crud, that scared the mess out of me! Who are you? Boo. Did you try to push me away? Hmm? I'm sorry, I don't think I know you. Hmm. It's me, your old pal, Greed. Ooh, I gave him the right voice, too. And you don't know me, you say? Hmm? Greed? What do you want from me? Hmm? I want you not to forget me. You will need me and my ruthlessness. How could you ever succeed without me? Hmm? Listen, I tried to change for a reason. Maybe I wouldn't have got far without you, but maybe I would have found a better life. Hmm? A better life? Hey, Colin, how you doing? I'm doing pretty good. You fool. You got what you deserved. You should have stayed with me. You would have gotten it all. But perhaps it's not too late. Yeah, it's all so confusing. Look. Together we can. What now? It's reason! Greed, are you trying to meddle again? Ha! Reason, you are not wanted here. Silence! My apologies for interrupting like this. Listen to me. It's true that he helped you to achieve your goals. But you were young. You're still young. Did you know, then, what you wanted? Sure he did. You did, I did, we all did. He needs me, and you, Reason, can't deny that from him. Only I'm trying to have him, uh, only I'm driving him to succeed. What else would you do? What else would, uh, that word weird. Who else would do it if not for me? Yes, you're not entirely wrong. But maybe all he needs is a push in the right direction. A new lease on life. Hmm. You have to trust me. Go and wake up Hope. He's the only one that can help you. Wait. Don't listen to his nonsense. What the hell? Hope? Greed? Reason? Yep. This dude's stuck in limbo! I knew it! He's stuck in limbo, and he's having to face the different parts of himself. Called it! So, he's completely lost hope in the last one, which means that everything that's happening right now, I can guarantee is happening in that split second before he actually killed himself. It's like he's having this whole experience right before. Okay. Can I leave now? Oh, what's this? Oh. It's a missing piece! I have short legs. No matter what, I'll never reach it. Dude, I know how you feel. I have short legs, too. But guess what? As short people, we are resourceful. We're gonna use the pipe. Ha-ha! Pick it up! What on earth is this? It's the missing piece of the puzzle, doofus. That's what it is. I have a feeling I'll be needing this. Yeah, you need it. Run! Read the weird little legs. 
Okay, where was that? I don't like this. What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh, I'm about ready to have to run. Okay, I'm gonna go save real quick. Save! What was that? It's gone. Okay. Okay. I'm just a crazy dude, stuck in my own mind. Wait a minute, where was that puzzle at? Oh, it was this way. Puzzle! Ah, perfect fit. Okay. I did it! Done, I think. What's next? I don't know. Oh, it's dark! The fire went out, but why? Nothing makes any sense. What's the meaning of all this? Oh! I beg of you, stop! No! Run away! I can't run into the darkness. Just don't come any closer! Go away! Stay away from me, please! No! No! I have no choice! Run into the darkness! Oh, did I die? What was I supposed to do? Oh. Never mind. I freaked out for no reason. <laughs> okay. So that was supposed to happen. <laughs> I panicked for no reason. Shush. Nobody saw me freaking out. I'm so confused. That thing got me. Hope. Has he abandoned me? Okay, that's darkness. You'll never catch me begging. Uh, I don't know, if that big old creepy thing's coming after you, I'm pretty sure you'd start begging, please go away. I have a face that just... Yes, Kevin, I have added. Oh, I can run through it. Run! Explorer, this is Houston. Go ahead, Houston. Mission abort. Repeat. Mission abort. <laughs> it was the only one I found that I liked. Alright, what's this? These are contracts? Ah. Contracts signed by my customers and me. Mrs. Goodwin, Mr. Taylor. I didn't understand what was at stake when I asked them to sign. If only. Run through the darkness! Oh, a save point. Run through the darkness! Oh, I can't run through that darkness! Oh, I guess I gotta go back. Run oh. Are you scared, boy? Ha ha ha. Who's that? Yep, I don't want to talk to you. Oh, still afraid of the dark? Look at you, a grown up man afraid of his own shadow. Ha <laughs> ha. Just sh show yourself. Nope, I don't. Oh. Okay? This isn't weird. Hello? 
How does it feel, the obscurity? How does it feel to lose hope? Who's this? You reap what you sow. In answer to your question, I am agony. Oh man, I didn't give him the right voice. Okay, it's agony. Hmm. Oh well. Just leave me alone. I've had enough of you. I don't just vanish. I might seem malicious, but no one can survive without me. I endured you for so long. I can't take it anymore. Please, just let me be. I don't need you. You don't get it, do you? You won't learn without me. My purpose is to make you suffer. And in doing so, I keep you going. Forget you. You can't hurt me anymore. Soon, my friend. Okay, so we have met greed, reason, agony, and then I don't know whose voice is in pink. Um, we're into the light. We'll go ahead and save again. Oh, no, there's no entrance that way. <laughs> Just throw us down some candy and haul butt. Run away! Oh, hey, it's my parents! Mom? Dad? Why are you here? What is this? We are part of your memory. We are your parents. We aren't reason, hope, love, or anyone else. But we act as their instruments, going in places where they cannot. You're in a dark place, son. How do you feel, sweetie? I... I don't know. I'm not sure if I can... I'm not sure I can feel anything at all. And that's exactly why we're here, son. Your father is right. We are here to remind you not everything is lost. There is still hope. Something, still something to fight for. We understand it must be difficult to carry on, son. Huh? I miss you guys so much. Are you okay? Don't worry about us, sweetie. We will eventually meet again, but not yet. Let's just get this over with so we can get away from here, dear. You're right, honey. The coffee here is terrible. Son, we were sent by love. This dark place, you must escape from it. Otherwise, it will slowly consume you. I don't like this place either. What do I do? Close your eyes, son. Take a deep breath and focus, sweetie. Imagine light. I just read the chat. <laughs> yeah, I try to keep it as family friendly as possible. So if you notice, like if there's swear words and stuff, I usually skip them. So I try to keep it as family friendly as possible, including chat, especially since I believe my kiddo is also still lurking in here. Ooh, it's bright. That just blinded me. Okay. This is different. I'll say. This fence is missing a piece. I'm almost tempted to fix it. It's a saw bench. There's also some wood there for fixing the fence, perhaps. Oh, no, don't. We don't want to go to dark. We're in light. We're in light. We want to stay in the light. Oh, wait, what's this? Ah, oh, a potato patch. I love the smell. I will say, if nobody has ever smelled a potato patch or a tomato, um, tomatoes growing in a garden, they smell awesome. What a charming little house. I wonder who lives here. Honey? Hmm? Did you fix the fence yet? Sorry. No, not yet. Take your time, honey. I ba I'll bake an apple pie in the meantime. Mmm, I like apple pie. Alright, Colm. Have a good one. See you next time. 
Uh, okay. Honey. I didn't recognize her voice. She sounded around my age, though. Gotta admit, that felt pretty nice. Oh, I bet this is a world of what his life could have been. What is this? <laughs> I'm sorry, that just cracked me up. Okay, hmm, I'm gonna walk into this shed. Oh, look, the wall just disappears. No Wall? No wall. Wall? No wall. Wall? No wall. <laughs> I'm sorry, I cracked myself up. Shush! There must be a hammer here. Let's take a look. Got it. Well, this is cozy. It's so quiet and calm here. I kind of like this. Do do do! Run on your weird little legs. I don't mind fixing the fence. I'm gonna need some wooden tools though. Fix the fence, she said. Okay, I need to saw the plank a little shorter. Seriously fixing a fence. That should do. Fixing the fence. Okay, I'm gonna need a hammer and some nails. I have a hammer and nails right here. That should do it. Never thought I'd enjoy stuff like this. Oh. Oh, it's reason. Startled me for a second. You guys didn't even quit jumping over to the screen like that on me. I guess I go talk to Reason. Oh. I'm sorry, I overshot. I got a little too close to you. I know, six feet, right? Are you enjoying yourself? Yeah, I think I am. I feel like a stuck record. But what exactly is this place? I'm so pleased to see a little smile on your face. You are in the domain of hope. This place is an illusion, but it could reflect reality. An illusion? Yeah, I figured I wouldn't be able to stay here. Now, now, don't be like that. I told you it could reflect reality, didn't I? What's that even supposed to mean? Just look around you. Why couldn't this be your future? Why would I deserve anything like this? All those lives I ruined. You're way too harsh on yourself. You were just doing your job. All you needed was a push in the right direction. But you let it get under your skin, pervading your very being. Thank you. I did try, you know. But it's not an easy task. I let myself down. Well, this is your journey to recovery. It's not supposed to be easy. Here's a good chance to take, around, take a look around a little bit more. Recharge your batteries under the energizing light. You'll need it when you venture into the dark recesses of your mind. Thank you again, Reason. I'll do my best. So, this is the domain of hope. Does that mean that she's hope? Hey? Okay, I'm coming in. Oh, is that me leaving? I think I just left. Yep. And I wake up in the crud hole again. Great. Back to the crappy world. <laughs> That's just what I said! Let's say What are you supposed to be? I'm sorry. What was that little squeaky thing was? You're probably looking for Mr. Blackwell. Look no further as here I am. Why would I be looking for you? Isn't it obvious? You've come to see me live. Evidently, my reputation precedes me. Right. So what do you do? Still playing ignorant? 
Fine, I'll play along. I'm a man of many accomplishments. I'm brave, fearless, handsome, and quite popular among the ladies. However, I, George Blackwell, have mastered the art of cards. I'm invincible. Good for you. Well, I need to get going. Wait, wait, there's more to it. I could go on and on about my deeds. But you're new here, am I correct? Well noticed. In that case, please allow me to explain something. We're kinda, uh... Well, you could say we're stuck here. You don't say. See that gorilla over there? Looks like a potato head to me. Once a day, only one of us can leave. But only for a few hours. Keep talking. We had this agreement with the other people. Once a day, we play cards, and the winner gets the chance to leave. A chance to solve the puzzle beyond the door. Okay, that's not weird at all. Luckily, I am the master of the cards. I've never lost, and that's why it's me walking out that door at the end of each day. I get it. You're good. Do you think I could play too? You? Against me? <laughs> sure, kid. That would be hilarious. I look forward to it. <laughs> okay, I'm glad I gave him a pompous attitude. He definitely has it. Okay, Mr. Potato Head, can I get through? Oh, can I pass, please? Grr. Maybe later. Yeah, let's not... Let's not... Oh, wait a minute. Eavesdrop. I like eavesdropping. There's something fishy about him. I know. Against all the odds, he keeps winning. Sooner or later, his luck will turn. Still, it was foolish to agree to his terms. Today is our turn to shine. I hope so, dear. Yeah, probably not. Okay, that's darkness. I don't want to go to darkness. Alright. Ba -do -ba -do. Okay. We'll talk to you. Hey, what are you doing? That's rude, you know. It's kind of rude for you to be pointing out that that's rude. Hey! Stop shouting and leave me alone. Hey! Quiet! Hey! Why would you... I'm sorry, do you need help with that puzzle? No, I got this. Stop shouting at our guest. Can't you let him help you? You've spent several days going over that thing already. Quiet, woman. Mister, you don't shout at me like that. You better give him that puzzle or else. I'm sorry, my love. Fine. There's no way you can solve that, though. I'll still give it a try. Thank you. Whatever. Alrighty. Just cause a dispute between the couple. Ooh, room. Where do you think you're going? That's... That'd be my room, you know. Uh, sorry. Ooh, let's give him that, that stupid puzzle since I can't do anything with it because it's not letting me. See, I have nothing. There we go. Yes, give him the puzzle. You look like a smart man. Why, thank you. Did you need something? I'm struggling to solve this puzzle. Maybe you could help. You've come to the right man. I, George Blackwell, am the master of puzzles. Hand it over, please. Here you go. Now let me focus. This shouldn't take long. All right. Oh, wait a minute. He's distracted. Ha ha! <laughs> Dude, you were distracted. Ew! It's like a creepy... What the heck kind of painting is that? It's a safe made of thick steel. Is he hiding something? I need the combination to find out. Hmm. I'm sorry, but does anyone else think that that painting looks like a poor representation of Leatherface? What's this? Ooh! Oh! I'm... Yep, I knew it. I knew it. I just need a pen. I can write down the solution. 
That kid will be stunned to see how amazing I am. Maybe he'll even reward me. Ooh, exciting. Okay, judge your boy. Focus. The combination. Six. Six, four. Six, four, nine. Open sesame. All set. Now that I have my pen. Keep your pen in the safe. You're weird. Hmm. Maybe I should suit up to really impress that kid. <gasps> no, don't go in the closet! Yes, I believe that would make him super impressed. Oh no. He's gonna find me in here! Oh good. But then again, would that be too much? Yes, yes. I gotta play it cool. Time to impress. Yeah, go. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Bye bye. <laughs> I thought he was going to locate me in there. <laughs> that would have been bad. Oh, okay, so you do agree with me. That painting looks like a poor representation of Leatherface. All right. I'm, I was going to have a hard time keeping track of all these different voices. And I know I'm going to I'm going to be feeling it. It's going to hurt my vocal cords. Whew, that was close. Not awkward at all. All right. Oh crap. I can't remember the combination. <gasps> I can't remember the combination. 469 Oh, six. Oh, he remembers it. Okay, good. <laughs> six, four, nine. <laughs> I'm glad he remembered it. What the hell is this thing? Oh, I understand. He's cheating on cards. This gadget pulls an ace from his sleeve. No wonder he always wins. Ooh, sabotage it. Ah, <laughs> oh, I like this dude. You know, I think alike. I think I might just sabotage him. That should do it. He won't notice a thing before it's too late. All right, can I leave now? Oh, what the heck is those? Th what are those things? I have no idea what those things are. How's it going? Whoa, he's focused. Okay, so there's something else I have to do. Oh, wait, they're not blocking the room no more. Is it this room? Yeah. What the heck? What the heck is this thing? It's so mesmerizing. Oh. What? What well, what was the sound? Not that thing again. Oh, is it him as a little kid? I'm I'm scared. I'm a little boy. Yes. Here I am. Come closer. I don't like you. Go away! What's that? Are you about to cry? You're worthless. Please, go away. Even your friends at school are laughing at you. Oh, wait. You have no friends. Ha 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 ha. Your parents don't love you. They don't want you. They'll abandon you. Mom! Dad! Alright, so she's gotta be something. So it's gotta be fear. I I'm betting it's fear. Aww, your mom came in. What's wrong, honey? Did you have a bad dream? I, I heard the whispers again. Oh, my little boy. There's nothing to be afraid of. 
It's only your imagination. But there's someone in the room, Mom. I'm scared. There's no one here. Don't be afraid. Things just seem different when it's dark. But it's the same safe room as in the daylight. You should head back to bed. You've got a big day tomorrow. What day is it, Mom? Don't be silly. Tomorrow it's your birthday. It's tomorrow? Whee! Shh, Dad's sleeping. We should keep it down. Sorry, Mom. Just head to bed now, honey. Oh, okay, Mom. Good night, honey. Okay, so those little white orby things was a memory. I used to have nightmares when I was a kid. My parents were always there for me. Okay. Back I go! Doo doo doo. Can I talk to him now? Did you manage to solve the puzzle? It's way too di it was way too difficult for me. Ha! I only had to look at it once and I solved it. So very easy. But then again, these things are easy for me. Here, take this as proof so you can be amazed. Thank you. That's his room. First door. First door. This room. I gotta give the dude the puzzle. Hey, I managed to solve the puzzle. Thought maybe you'd like to have it back. You did, huh? I'm not sure. Just swallow you your pride for once in life, you old fool. Yes, yes, my love. Okay, then. Let's see it. Fourth. From the left. Circle. And. Triangle. It's time, my dear. What time? To play cards. You can join us, I guess. Of course he can join us. He helped you. <laughs> oh, so funny. Alright, the rules are simple. The winner gets the right to leave. Let's play cards. Oh, do I actually get to play cards or is it going to be like automated? Hey, how are you doing? I wonder if Mr. Blackwell will win again. I wouldn't count on it. You're in for a surprise. Huh? Anyway, I feel lucky today. Ha! This game is not about luck. It's about a game of skill. And thus, there's only one possible outcome. You're way too confident, Mr. Blackwell. You can't always win. Time will tell, madam. Always the same topic. Can't we just get along? Let the best player win. No. There's something fishy about him winning all the time. You're right, dear. But we're prepared. Huh? Let's just play, okay? Alright then, show me your hands. Queen of spades. Ten of hearts. Jack of clubs. Eight of spades. King of diamonds. The new guy is winning! Mr. Blackwell needs an ace to win. I've already forgotten who gets what voices. <laughs> There's no way he can pull that off. Oh, you fools. Watch me. Uh, what is that? Mr. Blackwell. I knew it. He's cheating. No, it's just that you weasel. You don't understand. I'm so close. You don't have what it takes. Shut up. Calm down, please. Dear, you know what to do. Yes. Let's do it. Oh my god, they're gonna murder him! No! What? Wait! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my lord! Oh my what? The dude's just sitting there. What? They just butchered that dude. What is. What? Oh, that's Mrs. Goodwin. With her bunny rabbit. The heck? What 
What the heck was all that? My good question. What the heck just happened? I need to keep moving. Okay, that's not weird. Oh. It's an old film projector. Seems to be missing a film reel. Oh, that that's not weird. Okay, it's darkness. I what is this? The heck is this machine? Good question. Oh. Again with the red spinny thing, I don't know what that is. Ooh, film reel. I need that. It's a workstation for cutting the film. Oh. What is this? I, 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 I don't know what to do with it. Okay. Goodness gracious, you. You keep startling me. How do you feel? Confused. What's going on, Raisin? You're making progress. Sure as heck doesn't feel that way. Yes, but only. but you can only restore yourself little by little. You need to wholly understand things. Because simply knowing something doesn't mean you understand it fully. And some things you can only grasp by finding yourself. By finding hope. I got it. Find hope and all my problems will be solved. There's no need to be sarcastic. Things are never that simple. But you already knew that, didn't you? I'm sorry. I'm just struggling to grasp any of this. You don't need to. Not now. But, excuse me. But carry on. And eventually, you'll realize it all. Uh, thanks for the encouragement, Reason. Stay strong. Oh, it's a film reel! I need that! Oh, he just disappeared. Run on your tiny legs! Oh! I'll pick it up because it's probably useful. Like all the stuff dropping from the wall. <laughs> Alright, so the creeper dude is... No. Well, this must be the work desk for cutting. I want to try it. Oh! I have to put them in order. Okay. Um, that was it. Okay, sure. I bet that wasn't it. Wonder, would this fit? Oh! Okay. Oh, 
boy! How are you doing, sir? Not too shabby. Uh, who are you? Oi, it's me, Comfort. Comfort, eh? So, what have you got for me? Oh, this time I'm offering you a bottle of great scotch. But don't knock it down like a cowboy. Savor it. Well, I can appreciate a good quality scotch. The last time I had some, it didn't end too well. Oi, but I have to offer you some comfort. You couldn't find me from coffee anymore, so we needed something stronger. In this case, whiskey. Yeah, well, let's have some. It'll get you going again. Oi, what's wrong? I don't feel like that would help now. But I need to comfort you. Just have some. No, thank you. I'm fine. Oi, just take a swig. No. That was messed up. Huh? What's that? What did I find? Bottle bottom. Okay. What's over here? Darkness. Where's that? Pro oh, there's the projector. Oh, there's no picture. Something must be missing. How about a lens cap? Who would have thought? Whiskey bottle bottom works as a lens. Alright. Wait, I, I didn't want... What? Okay, I think I put them in the wrong order. Okay, so I had to have put them in the wrong order. But I will go ahead and save. Okay, so... Hang on, let's look at that again. Okay, so it's a wheelchair, a clock, a door, and a rocket ship. Hmm. I'm going to go with that. That looks like it's a good order. I don't know. That's... That seems to be a decent order. It makes sense. Like, he was a little kid with the rocket ships. Old men with the... I don't know. I don't know. I'm just taking guesses. Are you serious? I've been running back and forth, back and forth, and it's right there? Oh my goodness. Alright, well, it didn't do anything, so that can't be the right order.
It's probably going to make this TV light up. Okay, so... I don't know. I'm just guessing here because I have no freaking clue. There's like no hint as to what it needs to be. Ugh, I hate that. Maybe I wonder if it's events I've encountered in the game. All right, so oh, now I'm just going with backwards order. Probably not. Nope. What is the combination? Okay, so you have a... There's a rocket ship. You have the wheelchair. And then there's a door. And then a clock. Hmm. They have to go in a specific order. I don't know, alphabetic order? No. What? <laughs> Order do I need it to be in? Alright, I hate doing this. I really do. But I have no clue. So I'm gonna find out. Give me one moment.
Okay. I hate doing this, but sometimes you get so stuck and it's like there's so many combinations. I don't feel like sitting here forever trying to figure out the combinations. So. This is the correct combination. Nope. Okay. Mm. What the heck? Why am I on stage? Hey. Who are you people? Hey. Can't you hear me? What the heck? This is unexpected, is it not? How can I be of assistance? Who, who are you? Oh, you don't know? And yet, it was you who found me. Tell me, what were you looking for? Who were you looking for? I'm looking for hope. Ah, uh, yes. Tell me, do I look like hope to you? Okay, come on, who are you? I am agony. I'm the fire that burns you from within. The fire that makes you hurt, but also drives you. You, you don't know what you're talking about. Oh? Ha 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 ha. I hold all of the power over you. You gave it to me. We don't need to do this. Not now. Help yourself instead. And go and find hope. Forget me. No. I'm not leaving before I overcome you. Maybe you've got a backbone after all. You choose pain. <laughs> oh, what the heck? What do I do? I, I, I can't do anything. Was that supposed to happen? It's a door. Chapter 2. Loss. Okay, where am I now? Hey, aren't you Mr. Taylor's dog? Who's a good girl? It's a doggy. Oh, I'm rowing a boat! It sounds like somebody in a bathtub. What's that, girl? Oh, you want me to fish? Well, there seems to be a fishing rod on board. Pay attention to your rod. Once your fish starts baiting, quickly press A. I could actually go fishing. Cool. I get to go fishing! Woo! I caught a fish. I don't want to quit. Fish! It seriously sounds like somebody's do doing the sound effect is from a bath bathtub. 
It's actually kind of cool. Nice little intermittent little little things to do. I want another fish. Give me fishy. What, no more fish? Oh, come on, I want to fish again. Fine. Hey, I got a fish. I got two fish, dude. Two. You know, my father used to take me fishing. Happy childhood memories. Okay, let's get a little farther. Let me know once you see more fish, girl. Oh, it's not gonna end well. I'm gonna like pull up some crazy monster thing. What is that? Hello? Hey, honey. Did you get any fish yet? Yes, I did. Wonderful. In that case, I'll start pre preparing some potatoes. Uh, okay. Such lovely weather. But it's getting dark, so please come home soon. You have fun now, honey. Uh-huh. Thank you. It was that girl again. I don't recognize her voice. Well, I might as well do a bit more fishing. I hope the dog is okay, too. Fish! Good spot again, huh? Fishing! Why didn't let me... Fi oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. No. No. Oh, I can actually go backwards. Oh, I have to push the... Okay. Oh, I can't... I, I can't see... There we go. Fishing! I got a fish! Another fish! Okay, that's enough fish in here. Let's keep going! Honey, are you coming home soon? It's getting dark. You know I always get nervous if you're on the lake after dark. Okay, I'm heading back now. I caught plenty of fish. Okay, honey, see you soon. All right, let's head back home, girl. Into the darkness I go! Oh, I can't go any further. <laughs> okay, so how do I go back home? I guess I just go back the way I came. You know, I'm not sure what this place is. I don't understand how I got here. Or how you got here. But I'm glad you're with me. Still, this whole journey... Is this some kind of limbo? Dude, I've been saying this from the beginning. Moments like this makes me think... 
Did I make a horrible mistake? Yes, it is never the answer. Taking your own life is never the answer. I'm not sure if I'm even going the right way. Oh, I am. Okay. <laughs> I was going the right way. Who are you? Tell me, why are you here? Self-loathing. I don't think I'm a bad person. But I've hurt so many people for my own selfish gain. Tell me about it. Well, I've done everything by the book. I mean, I've done nothing illegal. Just my job. But it involved dealing with people who were in desperate need of help. And yet I took away the last of their hope. Even though it's alright, according to the law. Yes, I'm aware of the nature of your work. I see a conflict between you and your work self. You must see it yourself. Yeah, I do. So? Do you think you're doing anything to contribute to this problem? I tried. But I'm afraid I've crossed the point of no return. So I went to resign to change the course of my future. But at that very day, I got to sign on as a partner with this company. My, background, my backbone snapped like a dry stick, and so I kept going. Interesting. You were aware of the conflict, but you decided to ignore it? Sure, you got the partnership, but there's more to it. Ah, uh, our time seems to be up, Mr. Price. I'd like to talk to you about your childhood the next time we meet. I'm sure we can find some answers there. So he went to go see a psychiatrist about his problems. Or, not necessarily a psychiatrist, but at least a therapist. Oh, I'm back here again, huh? Uh, okay. Where am I now? Save point! Is it a safe tied with a ribbon? <laughs> huh? Someone put a ribbon on the safe. I need to figure out the combination. Will someone come in and tell me the combination? Nope. But I don't like the idea that I can hide for some reason. Last time I saw a hide spot before anything else. There was the creepy monster! Oh, what's this? Locked. It's locked from the other side. Oh, it's a puzzle. I like puzzles. I like puzzles. Oh, it's one of those slidey puzzles. Okay. What the heck kind of picture is it supposed to do? Hmm. Alright, so I know that this needs to go there. This needs to go there. This needs to go there. This goes there.
Okay, that looks correct. Creepy looking face. It's missing a piece though. Oh, another memory. Memory. Huh, one of these things again. I feel dizzy. Mom, I want cake. Don't be silly, honey. We'll cut the cake once your friends come by later today. Are you sure they're coming? Yes, I'm sure. Oh, okay then. But before that, you need to go tidy your room. Okay, Dad, I will tidy up after breakfast. What are my old news old what are my old ears hearing? You promise? I promise I'll tidy my room. That's great, honey. That's exactly how big boys like, like you behave. Oh, Dad, did you have something for our boy? Yes, Mom. I believe I have something here behind my back. Happy birthday, son. Happy birthday, honey. What's in the box? Go ahead and open it. Oh, look at his face. Whoa! Constructor set number 649. This is the best present ever. I love you, Mom and Dad. I remember my birthday. How I miss my parents. Oh, nope. Alright, I still don't have the piece that's missing. 649. 649, that's the combination. Could it be that simple? 649. Wait a minute, that's the same combination as that other dude. Hmm, what's this? A rusty old piece. Surely it has a place. Hide! Oh, it won't let me hide. Okay. Puzzle piece. Wrong, wrong button. And somehow that unlocked the door. Gotta love the logic. Yeah, gotta love the logic there. This place seems familiar. Reminds me of my childhood home. Oh goody, another hide spot. It's an old clock, it's missing pendulum. It's a lampstand. One that's missing a bulb. Alright, so I need a pendulum and a lampstand. Or, er, psh, lampstand. Pendulum and a, and a light bulb. Do, do, do. I'm gonna keep going this way first. There's another hide. Lovely. Okay.
All those valuable memories. But they're a thing of the past, so what's the point anymore? Oh, goodness gracious. Can you quit doing that? Oi! Try to think positive. Maybe you could forge new happy memories. And he just disappears. There, it's not locked anymore. Oh, Kevin, I don't know what happened about the sound alert. Just go ahead and give you those points back. Go ahead and give your points back. I don't know what happened there. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I'm back where I start. It's like a portal. Looks like an altar that's missing something. And of course it's missing something. Everything's missing something. Missing a bulb. Aha! Huh? huh? What's this? This will be useful. I got a light bulb! Again with the red glowy thing! I don't like that. Need to find a fuse. Okay. So I need a fuse. Oh, there's a door. I can see it right here. There's supposed to be a door here. Oh, there's a hole in the wall behind the couch. I couldn't see it before. Oh, it's another one of those poozles. Hmm. Oh. Oh, I just rotate them.
gonna be an anchor. A pendulum. I know where to put this. <gasps> Holy crap. Okay. Give me that. Did that do? Ah, see, I told you there's a door here. I still need a fuse. Good thing I took that bulb back. Oh, a fuse. Collecting fuses is a hobby of mine. Give me that light bulb back. Holy crap! Oh. Goodness gracious. Hey! Where are you going? Go away, Greed. Now, you're just saying things like that you don't even mean. Take me with you again. I'll show you the way. Tempting, is it not? Forget reason, that old fool. He's all bark and no bite. Always talking and never doing. You think he can help you? I think... I... I don't know. See? Take a look and see we're being humble as taken you. Take my hand, and we will bow to no one. But you also played a role in my downfall. I don't want to talk... I don't want to walk that path once again. You fool. You're weak. You think you can resist me? Ha ha ha. I'm your addiction. No matter what, I will always be there. Yes, you're my addiction. But I made a mistake and confused you with ambition. I won't let you out. We'll see about that. Greed. Will he ever leave me be? Oh, goodness gracious. They need to quit scaring me like that. All right, where was that fuse? Not this way. I went the wrong way. Oh crap. Run, run, run. Don't find me! Go away! Go away!
Is it safe? Oh, Mr. Potato Head! You're blocking my door. It's okay. I don't need to go in there. I need to go... This way? Was it this way? I can't remember! No, not this way. I think it was this way. Yes. No, not the fuse. The bulb. Then the fuse. Okay, I got the fuse. I just walk across the floor. Oh look, another memory. I wanna look around first. Okay, nothing else to see. Another memory! Huh, another one of these things. It's so hypnotic. Oh, it's an elephant. Wait a minute, I'm seeing numbers. There's a seven. Did you pack your toys yet, honey? Uh, I'm doing it now, Mom. I don't want to move. But Dad says business isn't good during the recession. Whatever that means. I'm almost ready. It's time to go, Mr. Armstrong. See you soon, buddy. It's your turn, Mr. Snouty. What's that, Mr. Snowy? You don't want to go in there. Huh, you're right. I'll hide you so I so you can stay with me. But you must be quiet. Mom won't find you here. Shh. All packed. Did you pack your toys yet, honey? I'm ready, Mom. I didn't understand when I was a kid. My parents' business struggled, so we had to move out. I wonder what happened to Mr. Snouty. Oh, he's probably still in there. I'm gonna take that bulb, thank you. Didn't do any good. You think the bedroom would be up here?
What's this? Oh, that's outside. Wrong button. Okay, nothing up the stairs. Alrighty. I haven't been in here. Let me let me see. I haven't found anything in this bathroom of use. Oh, there's the Huh. It's a play tent from my childhood. Mr. Snouty. Whoa. Is that really you, Mr. Snouty? I have my childhood toy. Okay. I have to do a quick hide. Oh, hang on, hang on. What was what was through that hole? I can't remember. Nothing, that was just where I got the light bulb. Wrong area. Oh yeah, the guy that guy was covering this doorway. I'll just put you here, buddy. All right, Kevin. You have a good one. Have a good sleep. I'll see you next time. Hope you have a beautiful, magical day. All right. Well, that just moved because I placed an elephant on it. Secret passageway. With an auto save point. That seems promising. Oh, it's a cafe. Oh, my sit. Huh. This reminds me of my parents' coffee shop. Before they went bankrupt. Speaking of coffee, I could use some. Oh, right on time. Coffee. Ground coffee brewed from the best of our beans. Please enjoy, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Ah, uh, finally a moment of peace. At least that's what you thought. And coffee. How I've missed you. Are you ready to confront me now? After all these years? Uh... Who are you? I am Loss. Loss? Yes, I'm here to help you. Please, don't let my appearance scare you. My intentions are pure. But why Loss? I am the creation of Agony. He may seem malicious, but he created me to reach you. I don't understand. Why are you here? I already told you, I'm here so you can confront me at last. I am the loss you felt all those years ago. 
My parents? Yes. You were so young. Young and too proud. You ignored me. That action created something else. Huh? I do miss my parents more than anything, but it was easier for me not to think about it. Why would I torture myself with the memory? It would never bring them back. You're not wrong. They're gone. But their memory is not. You need to treasure it. Do not avoid the thought of your parents. And that is why I was sent here. You need to go through me and deal with what was once forgotten. It's the only way. Okay, okay. How do I do that? You search yourself. You wake hope. You'll know when the time is right. Uh, thanks. I will say this game gets a little deep in the whole idea of, you know, dealing with different emotions and stuff. Ah, back with the therapist. Last time you told me about your work and how you got better, how it got the better of you. You had the chance to resign, but you did not. You kept working, even when it was burning you so slowly from the inside. Today, we are trying to delve deeper. We will find reasons behind your decisions. If you say so. Tell me, does it feel like you're in control? Uh, yeah. I believe so. I mean, I struggle to stand behind my voice. Yes, I thought as much. I suppose you also feel insecure. Yeah, I don't feel like I have much left to give. What do you think? Why is your self-esteem so low? I wish I knew the answer. Tell me about your childhood. What would you like to hear? Just an overview. How was it? I'm aware of the tragedy you had to face. Yeah, I do miss my parents. I had a happy childhood, but it ended way too soon. I'm sorry to hear that. Let's revisit that a little later. Could you tell me more about your parents? They were the best, kind and understanding. They owned most idyllic coffee sh they owned most idyllic shop coffee shop. I suppose that explains why I love coffee so much. Anyway, during the recession, their business started to struggle. It got to the point where we had to sell our house. Do you think these events have potentially caused you ur your urge for success? Ah, our time seems to be up, Mr. Price. I'd like to hear more about your childhood during our next session. There's some very short sessions. Press A to open your eyes. Chapter 3, Forgiveness. Hey, you okay? You look distracted. Whoa. Is that you, Charlie? Eh, how funny. What are you doing here? You invited me, man. We need to get you some beer. It'll do you good, trust me. Uh, show me the way. What the heck is on that spit? Cheers to old friends! Cheers. The creepy ice cream truck is back. <laughs> I hear it outside. So it's been, what, seven years? Nine years. Whoa, that long already? Yeah, tell me about it. What have you been up to? That, my friend, is a long and boring story. The usual kind of boring, you know. I settled down, got married. I'm also going to be a dad in a few months' time. Whoa, congrats. I'm very happy for you. You deserve everything. Thanks. And how about you? For some reason, we didn't keep in touch after you moved for work. 
Speaking of, did you get the job? Unfortunately, yes. Huh? It's a long story. I'd like to hear it. I need a beer first. You with me? Down the hatch. That was quite a story. I'm sorry to hear about how things went for you. Don't be. I made my own choices, my own mistakes. But still... You're a good person. Thanks, Charlie. Oh yeah, I forgot something. I'll be back in a minute. It's a doggy! Who's a good girl? Okay, don't go that way. Oh, the doggo's gone. Hey, it's Reason! Reason. Someone's feeling cheerful. Huh, <laughs> yeah. So, how do you like all this? Surrounded by friends? In the warmth of the night? I feel welcome and safe here. Even hopeful. You've come so far. All the things you've gone through, they're like fuel for hope. You're close to releasing the light inside of you. Sorry, I don't mean to be rude. But I just want to relax now. For now, I need to forget about everything. No offense taken. In fact, I encourage you to recharge with all this warmth. Thanks, Reason. Oh wait a minute! I'm at I'm at, it's like a party at my house or whatever. Cause this is the house. Oh, there he is. There you are. I uh, wrote you a letter. It's important. Thanks. Can I read it? Not yet. I need to wait for the right moment. Uh, mysterious. Ah, uh, I know how it sounds, but promise me you won't open it yet. I promise. Thanks. You'll know when the time is right. Okay, then. Where are you going? Who are you? No. Come find me. I knew it. His wife, so to speak, is Hope. Okay. Oh, come on. Am I at the nursing home? I am. I'm at the nursing home. Oh, crap. I know this place. This is where Mrs. Goodwin passed away. Out of order. Someone needs to fix the machine in the reception room.
Yeah, that's not creepy at all. Well, that was original. Not. Okay, there's something here I could use. This crank will come useful. I'm sure of it. Okay, I'm sure it will. Oh, goody. Passcode. Alright, door's locked. So I need a passcode. Oh, goodness. E5, F, pound 5. These are notes, I'm sure of it. So, E5, F sharp. He's long gone. You can tell by the smell. I'm not even moving anymore. Why are you still wobbling? Is there a glitch? Because he's like still pretending to walk. Or if I just... He's been doing this the whole time. I've never noticed. Alright, so I'm not sure what to do with the, the notes. Something funny about those curtains. Are those numbers? Is it nine? It's a machine of some kind. Let's see if the crank fits here. Perfect match. Of course, 649. 649, got it. 649 is everything. Oh, goodness gracious reason. Stop scaring me. I see you've taken steps towards finding yourself again. Towards finding hope? What choice do I have? Everything is in your hands. You keep questioning your purpose behind your journey and existence. But every step you take fills you with silent light. Can you please stop being so poetic and speak plainly so I understand? I'm merely pointing you in the right direction. See, I cannot tell you what it is what. Realization must come from within. Only you can do it. No one else. Yeah, I think I understand. The place must wake up some painful memories in you. Am I right? Yeah, Mrs. Goodwin. Good. You shouldn't confuse agony with malice. He is part of you and plays a role in all of this. Give yourself a chance. Give hope a chance. I'll try. Thank you for your encouragement, Reason. Thank you for listening to me. Alright, 649. CX. It's on that. What is this? Okay, I can't do anything because all the lights aren't on yet. What do you think you're doing? She's coming for you. 
Show yourself. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, it's got a face on it now. What the heck? It's got like a creepy face. You are not creepy at all. No, not at all. Okay, it's safe now. I love how it's, it's deception, not reception. I think I can get into that room if I move the couch. Oh, it's a rose! It's very hard to do. Got it. I'm the darkness boy. Fear me. Go away. One thing open. I just climbed through the window. What is this?
Look at me, looting drugs. Surely a syringe will come in use. Okay. Nope, not the syringe. Okay. Hmm. No. Alright, so it's gotta be it's four numbers. <phone rings> Out of order. Someone needs to fix the machine in the reception room. Okay. It was fun, but I already turned the crank. Alright, so nothing more in this room. Maybe this is the key. Those are notes, I'm sure of it. Hmm. Not sure what to do with these. Some notes. Yes, I know there's some notes. What do I do with the notes? Hmm. Well, there are four and four, which just matches the reception area. Matches the reception area, so there's there's some kind of certain pattern of notes that I need in order to complete it. I'm trying to remember all my notes. So I can't think of I can't think of any combination for these notes. Maybe I don't. Oh, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, hi. 
Why? I put some medicine in your... Irrelevant. No need to explain yourself. Okay. Who are you? Obviously, I am inspiration. Inspiration? You shouldn't be, you know... More aspiring? Yeah, maybe I should. But you left me behind a long time ago. We used to work together when you were younger. Playing piano, painting, building stuff. Those are some good memories. I wonder why I stopped. All work and no play made you a dull boy. Yeah, I suppose. You know, you could use me every now and then. Okay, so what do you have for me? I did write a small tune. It's a bit generic since you never questioned my creation. Anyway, it should help you on your path. Let's hear it then. Ah! First one and the last one. Got it. That's the answer to the puzzle. I knew it had something to do with these notes. Haha! -ha. So, first one and then the last ones. Got it. Thank you! Sorry for abandoning you, inspiration. Do, do, do. Holy crap! Oh! Stop doing that to me! Alright, alright, alright. Now I know the combination. So first one. Last one. Last one. First one, last one, last one, last one, right? Did I do anything? I don't know if it did anything. It didn't do anything! First one, what? Oh, goodness, maybe I missed something first. Okay. No, because it says... What am I missing? Okay, I'm going to go back. got to be missing something. Run, little man, run. First one. Last one. Last one. Last one. What else is there to do? Oh, there's a- oh my goodness gracious. There's a little lever. Oh my lord. Got it! That must be the right combination. Woo! No!
Yes. Yay. Oh, no. All right. It's an elephant! Why do you even try? You deserve nothing. You won't last the night. Give up. Now the red circle thingy, so I'm assuming that that means I'm doing something good. Alright, so now I just have one more. Where is that at? It's like nothing in here. Anything else in here? Nope, nothing else in here. Can't get in there yet. Okay, nothing else in here. Don't think there's anything more in here. Nope. Nothing more in here. Alright, nothing more in here. Nope. Just checking all the rooms because I'm missing something. Nothing over here. Oh yeah, that's right. There we go. Ha ha! Oh yeah, this is where the dude was like chopping up people. I saw that. Okay, I've gotten pretty good at these things. Oh. <laughs> 
No, I didn't want to do that. Got it. Still afraid of the whispers from the darkness? You're not worthy, fool. Nobody loves you. Be gone. Leave me alone. Yeah. Get away from me. Alright, so that should be the last bar off the door. Yes. Let's do a quick say. Oh. Oh no! No, no, run, run away, run away. I start running towards it. No. safe now. Alright. Now I save, and now I enter the store. Mrs. Goodwin! And her bunny! Mrs. Goodwin? No, I'm forgiveness. Mrs. Goodwin is the form you gave me. But... I'm sorry about everything. She never blamed you for anything. I know, but I do. I do. I'm forgiveness. Let me help you. How? Please, hear me out. There's a reason why you can't forgive yourself. It's all connected. Your past, your parents, how their business was taken away from them. Everything in life molds you. Yeah, and I did the same to Mrs. Goodwin. I took away her home. You've put so much time and energy into regretting that decision. Just why? Regret is all you seem to do. I just can't let it go. I don't think I can ever stop blaming myself. It's like something is stopping me. Maybe there is something more. Maybe you need to find that something. And then, in the throes of your journey, maybe you'll be ready to forgive yourself. I'm not reason, but I advise you to carry on. You're bound to find what you're looking for. Have faith, and you will restore yourself. Again with a therapist! Oh, excuse me and my yawn. Would you tell me, what happened after your parents' passing? They placed me in an orphanage, where I then grew up. It was okay, I suppose. I made good friends there with a boy named Charlie, although I haven't seen him in ages. Tell me more about it. Well, we were very close. But then when I reached adulthood, I moved to another city. I pursue to pursue a career from McDade, Bruton, and more. I do regret not keeping in touch with Charlie. I regret it all. It sounds like you're too harsh on yourself. Maybe you shouldn't dwell on the past. But now, I'd like to hear more about the death of your parents. Such tragedy is bound to leave a mark. Nah, it's fine, Doc. I try not to think about it. It's easier that way. Tell me, how did that make you feel? I felt sad, 
but I was able to shut it away. I got over it surprisingly fast. We all react differently to such loss. But could it be possible you never really processed their passing? Tell me, did you ever take time to yourself, just to mourn? No, not really. But like I said, it's okay. I don't need to. Mr. Price, I believe you could be suffering from trauma. It sounds like you're still in denial. Instead of processing your loss, you shut it away. Maybe in the silence, it's trauma molding your every decision? I don't believe that's the case, Doc. I mean, I do appreciate your help. Ah, uh, our time seems to be up. Please don't shy away from my words. Give us some thought, and who knows what you might find. Epilogue! Hope! Am I at the very end? Oh my goodness, I have made it! I must be close now. I want to see this through. To make sense of all this. Run through the dark! Do you really want to do this? You'll never vanquish me. Yes, I want to do this. Boo. Sorry, didn't mean to scare you. Ah, oh, perfect. It's you again. Hmm? How rude. I'm here to help you out of this crap hole. Huh? You heard right. And how would you do that? Don't underestimate me. There is but one condition. You shall never abandon me. And that's it. If you would just sign the agreement. Uh, I shouldn't. Don't be an idiot. I'm offering you a way, from, a, a way out from this torment. What's there to even think about? I suppose you have a point there. Just that, enough. Sign. Yes, reason! Help him! Enough! Ugh! Not you again! Silence! Don't sign it. Just think. The journey. Agony. Loss. Forgiveness. Love. You are healing. Here he is! Reason and his poetic wisdom. <laughs> Listen to me. You do not need him. Not anymore. But he's offering a way out. Not a way in which you want to go. Trust me, this last time. Yes, tear up their contract. Tear it up. Bye bye, agreed. What did you do? No! Bye bye. Poof. Come on, poof. I want to see you poof. Oh. I'm free at last! What? What's happening? You chose. Thank you! Welcome, Ambition. Ambition? There's a fine line between greed and me. You made the right choice. But without reason, I would have signed. Don't forget that we're all connected. You will need Ambition once you're out. Out? Was a little smile on your face? Keep your spirits high. There's still something locked away, deep inside. You will need all, need your all to conquer it. Stay strong, you're almost there. Oops, I can't go that way. Prepare yourself. I'll be there.
My parents. Mom? Dad? Hey, son. How are you, honey? I, uh, feel more energized. I mean, I must be close now. That's great, honey. Keep going, son. What are you guys doing here? Are you okay? Don't worry about us, son. Your dad is right. You need to focus. Listen. This time, we were sent by loss. Huh? You don't want to hear it. But you simply must. Okay, what does he have to say? Loss brings painful memory. A memory you've locked away. Uh... I'm so sorry, honey. But you have to face it. You're strong. You will overcome this. I love you both. What do I have to do? Close your eyes and focus. Think of us. Oh, do we get to finally figure out what happened to his parents? But boring. All my toys are in the new home already. And I'm hungry. There's no food in the oven. Also, we don't have a fridge. Dad said they'll bring some pizza. I want pizza now. There's nothing there anymore. All the stuff is here in the kitchen. The new home is so much smaller. Oh well. Oh, they were in a, I bet they were in a car accident. I don't know how to tell time yet. But shouldn't mom and dad be back already? I'm going to eat at least ten pizzas. Dad says I eat more than a horse. Oh, they went to go get pizza. And they got in a car accident. My parents have said I shouldn't open the doors to strangers. I'll just be quiet. Hey kid, don't be scared. My name is John. I'm from the police. Would you open the door please? Hey, what's your name, kiddo? I, uh, something happened. I'm terribly sorry. But, hello, Lucas. Yes, it's so sad, his parents. Oh, goodness, he's finding out. It's so sad. There was a car accident. Where's mom and dad? I'm very sorry. They're in a better place now. Hey, don't worry. You might not want to hear it, but it's going to be okay. I don't, don't, no spoilers. I haven't played it yet. Someone will take good care of you. Oh, and before I forget, I was able to retrieve this from the car. I believe this belongs to you. Oh, it's his elephant! Oh, I'm so sad. Oh, what the heck? What? 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 You can't just throw that at me. I wasn't paying attention. You can't just do that to me. Run! 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 Keep 
running! What is this? What? What are you? It's reason. Reason. What the heck is that thing? It's the source of everything in you. Please stop. Speak plainly so I can understand. You must finally face it. The dark place inside you that's holding you prisoner. Insecurity. Unworthiness. The source of it all. And here you are. Ready to do so. I don't... Listen to me now. For I am the reason. Tell me, what is that thing? It's... Look closer. It's... Trauma. Yes. The source of all things in you. But now, after all these years, you have the chance to overcome it. I... Can't. It's too powerful. And what's even the point? You're on the brink of restoring yourself. But how can I ever overcome my loss? By accepting and dealing with me. But with my job, how can I go on? You found me, and together we'll rise. I feel empty. How can I become motivated again? Challenge my creation! What do I have left to fight for? I'm somewhere out there. Find me. But what if things go sour again? I'll be there to comfort you. How can I live with this misery? I exist for a reason. Accept me. How can I live with my fears? My only aim is to keep you from harm's way. How can I ever forgive myself? Through me. Okay. Okay. You see now. You're almost there. But you're missing something. Think. The letter. The letter Charlie gave me. That has to be it. I knew you'd get this far. You've always been determined. But at the same time, your insecurity negated your determination. Leaving you exposed. I've been trying to reach you. Waiting for the right moment. You're standing on the precipice. Ready to take that leap of faith. Please, let me help you. Courage. Of course. Courage. I have all I need. Hey, Mom. Dad. I understand it now. I shouldn't have suppressed my agony. I didn't face my loss. I made some horrible choices in my life. I never understood why. But I do now. I think I'm ready to restore hope. 
I've been searching high and low, but I can't seem to find what I'm looking for. And yet, all of this must hold a purpose. I've been led here by reason. If you are there, please, somehow, help me. Son. Mom. Dad? It is time. What do you mean? I don't understand. Your light. Let it shine from within. Welcome back. For you have been missed. Hope. Wh what? We are all connected. We are now complete. I, uh... Can you see it now? We are... We're a thought. We're his last hope. A journey in the blink of an eye. Please, hurry. No one else can stop him but you. Oh, I knew it! It all depends on you. What do I need to do? You know what to do. I don't care who you are, but this whole ending is like hitting me right in the feels, making me all weepy. Oh, I knew it. This is all happening right before. I'm here. There's so much to see. Don't do it. couldn't do it. Something. Something changed. Oh crap. Someone must have heard the shotgun. Hey! Is everything alright? Huh. That voice sounds familiar. Everything is okay. I'm coming in just to make sure, okay? Uh, okay. Oh, it's love! Oh my. What did you... I... I was going to... But something... Hey. Calm down, please. It's okay. My name is Jen. I just moved here a couple days ago. Uh, my name is Casey. Nice to meet you, Casey. You too, Jen. And thanks for checking on me. I'm sorry, I'm such a mess. Don't worry about it. Don't you want to talk about it? Uh, there's a good cafe nearby. That is, if you like coffee. I love coffee. Alright then, let's go. Oh my goodness. Hey guys, thank you very much for playing Distraint 2. It was a crazy amount of work to create this little game. But here's hoping you like it. Oh my goodness, that ending just hits you in the feels. I'm actually kind of glad I don't use, um, I'd be very embarrassed <laughs> if you guys could see me right now because I'm like all teared up and everything. I liked it. I really like how they, because the last one I was so mortified on how it ended. And then you play this one, and then you find out that he actually did, didn't do it. 
But I absolutely just, I love the whole message behind it too. That no matter what you might be going through, you know, there, you know, there's always hope, you know, and it's up to you, you know, to find it within yourself to keep going. Oh, goodness. I'm all weepy. <laughs> it's making my nose run. My eyes are all watery. But I will say that, I hate to say, I mean, I don't really feel this way with games a lot, but I, I think this was actually a very beautiful ending. This was a beautifully made game. I don't know what else to say about it. Yeah, because I, I actually just finished it, uh, um, Distraint, a little bit ago. And, uh, I didn't know what was Distraint 2, like, what was going on with it. I didn't know if it was a whole new storyline or what. And when I saw it was him, I automatically thought, okay, he's in limbo, and he's trying to reconcile with things. And then I was like, wait a minute, this is all happening in that split second before he makes that decision, and that there's a possibility to change it. And I was right. Um, but that whole ending, you know, with him reconciling with the different parts of himself, you know, that you're going to have agony, you're going to have loss, you know, but you have to keep a balance with everything. And then, like, the fine line between ambition and greed. But, yeah, that, that was actually a very beautiful game. I, I loved that ending. Um... I love the message behind it as well. It's just amazing. But, I don't know. I just, I really love the idea of this game having that whole message of no matter what, you know, there is hope. So I think that's that's a really beautiful ideal to mix into this game. Because I'm sure a lot of people out there can definitely relate to feeling hopeless or... You know, he was either, he, he was also dealing with not just trauma, but, you know, his, you know, insecurity. He felt unworthy and everything else just bundled up inside of him, which caused him to go down that path. And he had to face it and accept it. But, yeah. So, yeah, that was Distraint 2. Um, absolutely wonderful game. I, I highly recommend it. I really do. But, okay, I'm, I'm done with all the weepiness. Well, thank you guys for those of you who watched. Um, I really do appreciate those who hang out in the stream with me or watch it after the fact. Um, I appreciate every single one of you. And I really do hope that all of you have a beautiful and magical day. And until next time, bye bye